Explain what's just happened here. So we just come here, the bomb we come here, as you say, today is a school. And we know it's a fact that Russians have been targeting hospitals and schools. So I thought I'm pretty sure that it's actually the plane that's actually executed the school. So I'm like, only just after the tour, so it's about 12.30, so obviously there's people still at school. So obviously these countries, if you hit the school, obviously a lot of school children would have died. But Alhamdulillah, we're just here outside, no casualties, but also you can see a lot of destruction. And Alhamdulillah, it's empty. As you see, it's fresh, it's dust, it's here in the country. So, Alhamdulillah. Happy! Alhamdulillah. Warahmatullahi wa barakatuh, guys. We're here in Aleppo City. And as you guys know, the situation is really, really dangerous. There's only one road left that goes in and comes out. Um, so, we decided to start a new project. We want to make sure that Aleppo City doesn't end up like Madaya or Zabadani where people are starving. So, right now, we've just secured a warehouse. We made a call out to all of the charities. So any charities out there, we're waiting for you guys to respond. One Nation's already responded and they've pledged us 500 food packs. So today we're going to be bringing them um, and, and storing them and hopefully distributing them. Um, each food pack costs £17.50 uh, for a food pack which lasts approximately two weeks. So please get donating right now so we can help them secure these 500. www.savealepo.com and any other charities that want to help us, please get involved. Please contact us and check the link below. Assalamu alaikum.